Good afternoon, everyone. Nick Baum with Rockaway here, here with Oud Cars with Site Recon. So we're gonna go through today, kind of show you guys how we use our Site Recon and Play-Doh app. Uh, coming onto a property for a quality assurance visit, how we document things that we're seeing, whether they be good or bad, the communication to our crews as well as our customer, and how that plays a big part in the quality of service that we provide. So we're here at Villas in Nocatee, gonna go ahead and do a quality assurance visit. Once I get into that, I'm gonna start creating notes. So my first note is always an awesome template. Then I have these really great slider bars. So I can say turf quality, my turf is looking really, really good. I'm gonna go ahead and slide that up to five, it's excellent. You know, I can say bed weeds. So I can start taking a look at my beds. I can say, I can see a few weeds. We're in kind of a rainy period right now. I'm kind of okay with that. All in all, as I look around, don't see too much. I'm gonna put it as a four. It's good, but it's not excellent. It's not weed free. So then I continue to go down. I look at my edges. Is my edging good? Are the guys edging everything? The edging's crisp. Everything's looking great. We're gonna slide that to a five. Uh, my turf weeds, going back to our, our turf quality. Looking around, I don't see any turf weeds, nothing really popping up. Our agronomics do a great job. That's usually almost always a five for me. Uh, my last slider bar on this overall property assessment is the shrub health. All in all, my shrub health is looking great. So at that point in time, I will go ahead and hit my next button, which is gonna allow me to place a pin of where I am. So at that point in time, once I go through my, my property assessment, I'll start looking around for notes that I would make. So, you know, do we need to put some shrubs over here? You know, we may want to. So I'll, I'll add another note. We'll call it a proposed solution, which is kind of how we word that. Um, and say, hey, you know, I think it'd be a really good idea if we planted a few Laura Petalum in this area. So what I can do is I can make another note. I'll go ahead and label it proposed solution. We'll use 11 three gallon Laura Petalum in this area. Rough estimate, usually pretty close though. At that point in time, I'll go ahead and I'll take a picture of the area. Awesome. So usually when I take a picture and it's for a proposed solution, I wanna go ahead and draw in what I'm proposing, not only so the customer can kind of see a general location, but once they sign off on it, I can then hand that over to my landscape installation crew. They know exactly where it's gonna go. They know exactly where the plants are gonna be. It, it lessens the amount that I have to talk to them. It also lessens their confusion at the end right. of the day. Easier follow-ups. Exactly, yeah, much easier follow-ups, much less communication required. Um, as much as we all like talking with each other, it helps. <laughs> <laughs> so I'll go ahead and I'll draw in one, two, three, four, five, going really simple with just some good old fashioned X's. 10 lower petalums. Go ahead and put that into my notes. And the great thing is because I'm being tracked with GPS on this property, my pin gets really close to where I am already. I'll just go ahead and slide that into this bed about where it's gonna go. Create that note. And it's on my, on my property now. I bet it saves six months of somebody's salary in the latest from a sales uh, um it would turn it around faster too so i mean it is literally a no-brainer took the chance and started working with you guys but i continued to build my separate estimate alongside of it to compare okay what would i have done if i worked based on averages and if i remember correctly it was uh it, it was roughly 0.03 acres per door different, uh, which equated to about $150,000 price difference from what I would have proposed compared to what I did propose. It's been a huge tool for us. Um, we like the pricing structure, um, how the credits work. We like the turnaround time. Um, give it a try. I think, I, think if, I think if anybody gives it a try, they're probably not going to. Maybe like a year ago? And I think that we forgot how to, completely forgot how to do our jobs without it about six months ago, which is frustrating in a different way.